exciting for us with Martina McBride coming on board and uh, a celebrity of her stature. It is our arrival into New Orleans. It's a way of saying, here we are to the city. I do want to say thanks to Royal Caribbean for having us today. And also congratulations to all the contest winners who've flown in from all over the country. This is my first time on a cruise ship. I'm so excited. I, t I got to have a little tour earlier. It's so awesome. I think my teenage daughters would love to come on a cruise. I think we all would. Um, it's actually something that we've talked about for a few years, is taking a family vacation. And uh, you know, I, you just never really know what it's like until you see it. Now that I've seen the, what it's like and how much fun it would be, it's definitely something that we're considering. Good morning, good morning, good, good morning. morning. Captain Frank. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to have you on board. Thank you. What do you feel about my yacht? It's beautiful. It was great to meet the captain. I mean, he was very nice and um, you know, just to see the operation, the, sh the how huge it is, and how many you know buttons and <laughs> things there are to do. I mean, it's amazing. And um, so, he, yeah, they, I got to blow the whistle, which was kind of a powerful. I felt like I was in charge for a minute. <laughs> Wow. We're thrilled to be back in New Orleans. It's such an exciting city, so much to offer our guests, uh, both on a pre or a post stay, and we encourage people to explore this wonderful, charming city. Coming back here to the Gulf has been a big boon, you know, going to Galveston, to Tampa, and now here in New Orleans. It's a huge market that we hadn't tapped before, and uh, it's, it looks to be a very, very promising itinerary. But the Voyager had a great, great loyal following in Galveston, as you know, and now we're over here in New Orleans.